Hello guys, welcome back to ServiceNow 911. In today's video, we are discussing about name value type field. This field is not that much common, but in case you have to use it, let me show you how to use it, how to retrieve it, how to access it. Let me go to my ServiceNow instance. This is my incident form. I have added a separate field here in the experiment tab. You see test name value. So this is how it looks like. It comes with name and its value. So if you want, you can add a new row. You can delete a new row. Let me add a new row. Test one, two, three. So this is the name. This is the value. Okay. When it comes to the creation of this field, it is as simple as the other fields. You just need to go to dictionary entry, provide this type name value and provide a name just as an ordinary field you have to add this field now let me show you how to access these values how to add the values via script i have this script ready for you let me show you one by one just copy it so you see all these are operations let me show you one by one so now i want to add a new pair here just use this uh, you know this basic glide record thing okay after the name of the field, you have to provide the name. OK, so now what you want to add? Let me add some house number. House and then you have to provide the value here. OK, one double zero four. So after that, I'm just updating the record. So now click on run script. So this is the house. OK, a new key value field is added. Just remember the syntax here. So this is the case to add a new row. But if you want to update the row again, just uh, let's say I want to change the house number. Just do like this. Give this same and update. OK, it will find the house row and update the value. Run it. You see the house values updated to 1005. Now let me print how to print the values of name value field. So this is how we have to print. So the very first one, it is displaying everything. And for the second one, it is displaying only the value of country. Just run it. So here you see the very first one is printing the complete list. OK, country, India, city, Delhi, pin this, 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 like this, everything. And the second one is displaying India because I want to display the value of country. So what is the value of country? It is India. OK. Just look at the script one more time. So in the second one, I am displaying name of the country. So here I have used dot operator and the name. OK, the value then will be automatically printed. Using this, we have displayed the complete value. But if you want to iterate it, if you want to use it one by one, in that case, you have to use for loop. OK, so just remove these comments. So look at the for loop where name in this field, the complete field, and then print name equal to only the values. Now click on run. So now you see this is the display of each row one by one. So in this way we access each name and value pair. You can update the values accordingly. So this is it for this video. Now we have understood the name value field, how to retrieve its value, how to update it via script and by normal ways. I hope you like it. Share your questions in the comment sections. Thank you so much. Bye bye.